solution. Then I asked her, I was like, so what made you think that, why did you take my drink? Because you could have not taken. Yeah, but because in my mind, like everybody says it hurt, it helps, it helps, it helps, but does it really help? Ah, because she had limiting beliefs. But had I not pushed the fact, hey, you can try it. Do you want it? Now she could have said no. That's fine also by me. But emotional intelligence in the sales process is understanding and listening to the person. And when they're ready, you offer the hand. If they're not, that's fine. So whatever she, 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 wawa, you're offering to Gretty, to uh, Chronically Chic, to Art 2, whatever it is that you guys are selling, because selling, remember, is serving. People say, yeah, like, I don't think the product is for me. I'm really sorry. It's not for me. I'm like, you know what? You're maybe right. It's not for you. I'm cool. I know the product works. I know it's the best. But if you're not, if you're not ready, that's absolutely fine. I always say pigeons and eagles don't have the same height. 